Hey guys, Gage Fraxcom here, and today we're going to be doing the review on the Razer Rift. So, the real thing about Razer scooters is it's two straight wheels that just go. There's no special thing about it, it's just like, like it goes, there's two, they stay straight, they don't swivel. Well, they just made a new scooter called the Razer Rift, which has a swivel on the bottom. Get closer so you guys can see it. So right here it's got a swivel which makes that all different. So I will leave the other video that we had just done in the link because that shows how these two work and we're going to be doing another review. So this fully turning wheel and the cool thing I like the deck for this reason. You got this you got a bigger view because you have to be able to you have to lean to get this thing to drift and then you got the regular old small deck but the grip is especially different because different because all the other scooters just usually have razor and it's like skateboard grip tape on it this is a just a piece of plastic that says anti-slip surface so you can't slip on it even though i slipped on it a lot but so this thing's been put through its paces, so we'll get on to the next thing. All right, bring it in. And that's the data we're bringing in is Flash Rider 360, and that's another Razor. This is the Razor Flash Rider 360. This has a has a spark bar, which yep. is not currently it's in not action. Phone. Yeah, because it's here. And if, this is also in the other video, so it has. Unlike a tricycle, it has swivel wheels. two swivel wheels. It has one big ginormous front wheel. And as you can see, he's lost the pedal for this one. I lost the pedal. It's got a it's got a very comfortable seat. It's shaped. Which is perfect. Because it's got the shape of your back and it still lets you lean back. And the handlebars are like in the right spot, so are the things. And you can just take your hand off the handlebar and pull the spark bar. I don't know if you guys can see that in the bottom. But I can see it. Kind of. Yeah, pick up the camera and move it on. And come over here and do the bar. So, this, and here's the bar to pull it. It's got nice turning. It's not that, it's not, it doesn't have a good turning radius when it's not drifting. But when it's drifting, you can make a 90 degree turn in like 30 seconds. So, it's really good. And I, the tires? I say to buy it. <laughs> But the bad thing about the tires is they're like a foam, they're like a really hard type foam and they will like often, they will start to erode after a while and they'll start to like slip around, so. But I've had mine for like years. three years, so. So it's being good. And, and, and the thing is, you can't, you'd think because of all that it'd make it heavy. Nope. And bad thing about going backwards, you can't go backwards because as you see I'm having like, trouble with you it. You always the, the flat back the wheels swivel wheels, turn. The swivel, after you get enough speed, you should be able to do it after you get enough speed. Alright, but that'll end our review.